Keep contacts up to date with dynamic newsletters, GetResponse style. To send a newsletter anytime, go to Messages on the menu bar and choose Create Newsletter. Select the campaign by using the drop-down list at the top. Send in plain text or choose from hundreds of professionally designed templates to make your newsletters really stand out. The templates are organized by industry category and can be added to a quick list of favorites. Click the preview to choose a template and load the HTML message editor. First, choose the name and email that this message should appear to be coming from. Additional from fields can be added by going to the My Account page. Next, enter a subject line. Click Personalize to see available contact data and predefined fields for this campaign, such as displaying the contact's first name. The template is loaded into the editor with random text used as placeholders. To change any area, just highlight the existing text and type or paste the new content. Highlight and delete any sections that are not needed. Click Personalize to use contact data and predefined fields to customize the message. The toolbar expands to show all the available editing buttons such as emphasis, justification, lists, color, and font size. Spell check is available in several languages. Misspelled words are highlighted in the editor and right clicking will display suggested corrections. To link to a website, highlight some text and click the Insert Edit Link button and type the URL. Click the Multimedia button to browse the audio, video, photos and documents stored in the multimedia section of the account and then Add to insert into the page. The editor can be resized by dragging the bottom right corner to allow more working area. HTML messages will also include a plain text version to ensure compatibility. Click plain text above the editing area to switch from HTML view. Click import from HTML to load the same text and then wrap long lines to optimize for plain text. Below the editing area, buttons can be found to attach a file and test the message by sending it to an email address. Click Spam Check to see how the message rates with Spam Assassin, including tips on what contents might cause the message to be blocked by filters. Click Save as Draft to exit the editor now and return later to make more changes before sending. Click Save as Template and enter a name to save a copy which can be later modified for future messages. To use the template, just click the Load Saved Template button in the Editor toolbar. Choose to track the click-throughs of any links contained within this message and to display the subscription reminder details at the bottom of the message. When finished, click Next Step at the bottom. Choose recipients for the message by highlighting one or more campaign contact lists. Click plus to choose if the message should only be delivered to contacts who are actively receiving the campaign follow-up messages or only the inactive contacts. If sales tracking is set up for the campaign, clients will be those who have completed a sale or sign-up. Contacts can also be selected manually to further narrow the list of recipients and the selections made here can be saved as an overall group for reuse later. Click Next Step and then choose to send the newsletter immediately or to schedule a future date and time for delivery. Choose whether a newsletter announcement should be published to followers of the RSS feed and a Twitter account, then click Next Step. A confirmation will be displayed when the message is successfully scheduled. To see the list of pending and scheduled newsletters, go to Messages in the menu bar and choose Newsletter History. Select the campaign to view by using the drop-down list at the top. To the right of each newsletter are links to open it in the editor 
test it by sending to an email address, delete it, and enable or disable the RSS feed. Click List Draft Messages to continue editing any messages which were saved as a draft.